New at noon for the first time, we are hearing from the teenager who was bitten by a shark over the weekend. WRL's Noah Klein is here now. Noah, that boy's recovering in the hospital. He is. We're hearing from him from his hospital bed while that leg recovers. 14-year-old Blaine Brown spoke about the moment he realized what happened and what was going through his head. My grandma was holding my hand. I was like, I'm not going to be okay. I'm going to lose my leg. This happened at North Topsail Beach. Police and first responders already happened to be in the area responding to other calls when this happened. People at the beach tried to help putting pressure on that wound and wrapping it with towels. Brown's family friend was in the water with him when this all happened. And I remember like falling down or something and turning back and looking at Blaine. And that's kind of like when I was like, hey, you got bit by a shark. I seen him. So he pulled a few tendons and has staples in that leg. Brown says he knows he's lucky and says he's just grateful it wasn't worse. Now, with a busy beach season just getting started, we're looking at how common shark bites are. I'm speaking with a UNC Wilmington professor about if this is something you and your family need to worry about. That's coming up tonight at 4. Scary stuff.